They met on countless occasions in domestic competition as well as on the European front. When Chelsea and Liverpool cross paths, it's never dull. Live action from Stamford Bridge is coming up right here on EA TV. Hello, it's a real pleasure to be with you from West London, from Stamford Bridge. I'm Derek Ray, and my commentary partner here on the gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. I'm very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It's Chelsea taking on Liverpool. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. And this is how it looks for Chelsea. Well, it'll be interesting to see how the wingers play today. Will they stay high and wide? Will they come in field and support the centre forward? And how deep will they come out of possession? They're going to be key to this formation. And this is how Liverpool will line up. Alisson gets the nod in goal. Trent Alexander-Arnold starts with Andrew Robertson in the wide defensive areas. Mohamed Salah plays with Diogo Jota in the wide positions. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. A match that should be chock full of talking points. Liverpool get it going. Gakpo. It did look on for them, but not to be. Chances on. Oh, and a wonderful stop. But hang on. Offside is the decision here. Chelsea. Well, Diogo Jota, a player with the ability to turn any game on his own. Stuart, what part might he play in this match? Well, Derek, he's certainly going to be the key player today. Last time out, he scored those two goals, but it was his general play that was outstanding. Getting on the ball, making things happen, and he got his reward with the brace. And I'm expecting to see exactly the same again today. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Very alert defending to put a stop to the chance. Kai Havertz and after the cross a tremendous block James and thwarted there following the cross tremendously strong in the tackle racing forward trying to catch them out Well, possibilities in the centre. Jota. Return to Robertson. Well, that's gone out, and it is going to be a goal kick. Enzo Fernandez, Conor Gallagher, 
Promising looking ball. Havertz, unable to keep the ball. Can he put them in front? Yes, is the emphatic answer. And you have to say it was on the cards. Well, as you can see, he gave the keeper no chance there. He looked so confident, didn't he? That's a cool finish. continues is there to be a response from Liverpool now there needs to be Jones trying to really get at the opposition here a well, disappointing end to the move needed to be more accurate than that from the keeper and a throw in then Couldn't hang on to it. Rhys James. Madueke. Jones. Well, that's a well-timed pass. Now, will they do it from here? It's gone in beyond the goalkeeper. And Liverpool are level. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. Good vision to set up the chance, and there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. So, a level contest. 1-1. One, one. Well, they have the ball once more. Salah. The game has been turned on its head. They have never stopped believing, and now they sense victory. Just look at this again. The combination play in the top third of the field was so precise. And what an emphatic strike it is from Salah. Hit with his laces. It's a great finish and a great goal. Having conceded then, it's up to Chelsea to articulate a response. N'Golo Conte. Bad pass. And they continue to advance, and a lot of options here. Henderson. Well, just look at his strength here. He holds off the challenge, he keeps his balance, and he finds the back of the net. It's a wonderful goal. No shortage of goals on this match. 3-1. Kai Havertz now Chelsea in a position of menace Conte and oh it's in we cannot declare this contest over they still believe Well, as you can see, the weight of the through ball is key to this goal, while the movement in the box is equal to it. It's such good timing. What a goal.
Well, they get the ball rolling again, and Chelsea are giving this a real go. Well, the electronic board lets the fans know. Three minutes of stoppage time. Gakpo. Salah. Well, he made that interception look routine. In truth, it wasn't. And the first 45 minutes have come and gone here at Stamford Bridge. Well, Mo Salah, a player who knows how to wow the crowds. And Stuart, that's exactly what he's doing here. Well, he's been brilliant. He finished his goals really well. He's shown a great awareness of how to find space. And his movement has caused them all sorts of problems. Surely he'll get his hat-trick in the second half. Well, the ball is moving once more. Not enough went to plan for Chelsea in the first half. Can they address what didn't go right? Jones. And can they create something? Robertson. Big chance. Well, just leaning back a bit and over the bar. And a substitution in the offing. Mateo Kovacic, Fernandez, Madueke, Kai Havertz, and the cross didn't beat the first man, deflected behind, corner forthcoming. Well, the crowd are doing their bit, can they find the equaliser here? They will now make use of the substitutes bench. And deciding to go short with this one. And a good looking ball. And still dangerous. James. Will he find the net? And he's missed it. Good heavens. Well, that's a big miss. That should have been the equaliser. And time for the change now. Fabinho. 30 minutes left for play. Thiago. And Diaz has it. Gakpo. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. And played through by Sterling. James. And return to Pulisic. Well, a classic example of how to intercept. This is looking threatening. Options in the middle. Can he put it away? So now a corner. So a personnel change then. Well, opting for the short corner. Delivery from Salah here. Flinging himself at it, the keeper. Trying to pick out a teammate. Not really the ideal clearance. And Chelsea get the decision from the referee. Sterling 
on the ball Joao Felix and Chelsea looking dangerous well it came to nothing in the end well the second half is ebbing away here what can Chelsea pull out of the fire Stuart well it's certainly been exciting but can they find an equaliser here they've created so many chances throughout the game but they just need the ball to drop kindly in the box from a cross or a set play it's going to be a frantic finale to this match he's protecting it effectively can he finish them off he's done it what a climax to this game Well, here's the replay. Just look at this pass from Salah. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Sterling just cutting off the supply Thiago Darwin Nunez Salah palmed away by the keeper Sterling Conte now Breaking at pace. James. And on to Felix. Kovacic. And now with Pulisic. And throwing himself up the ball. And that will be a corner. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Well, he failed to get it away properly. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Felix. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. Oh, there it is! A lifeline in this game! And what a finale we could be in for here! Well, that was a fairly easy finish in the end, but he still had to take it. He won't mind how they come, though. And the referee signals that this game is officially over and disappointment for Chelsea, you've got to say. Nothing for them for this game. Well, Derek, not quite good enough today. Yes, they only lost by one goal, but I never felt they were in control of the game. A frustrating day all round for the coach to think about for the next time. Another more than effective night's work for Mo Salah. Your thoughts on his performance? Well, I have to say that was impressive. Not just his goals, but his all-round play. He was excellent.